the icebergs. done this, I've done it at Manly too, and watched all the really amazing dogs that just like, come past. What's down there? <laughs> That's a swimming pool. See all these little scooters up here? Lots of people ride scooters. Yeah. And people yeah, muck around. And people on their phones, people on their phones. Yeah. Are we going to spend six hours getting through this one hour walking track? Whereabouts? Are we going to do that now? Yeah, why not? You want to spend six hours doing a one hour walking track? Yeah. So you want to stop every two minutes? No. Well, I'm asking you because I want to know how much filming you're going to do. Well, I can just walk along and the camera just the, the work on the okay. same. Alright, let's go. The camera will record where we walk to. <laughs> yeah, very nice. What is this? Uh, Bondo. Mm. 
<laughs> the old camera does a good job. I, I put down the power of the of the LC panel, so Yeah. See this walking track, see how it bends around the cliff? Yeah. It's very pretty, Stu. Well, very it's going to record what I'm going to walk. So we've got oh, okay. one hour of lovely daylight. <laughs> yeah. Enjoy it? Yeah, I love it. I nearly fell down, hurt my head. <laughs> I nearly fell down. Nearly an accident. <laughs> oh, oh, the wall. Give a little bite and sting. And you get through. Oh, sorry. That's all right. Well, that's scary. Good time. It's scary. I nearly fell back down there. Now, <laughs> yeah, what a lovely spot this is. Oh, this is. No, no, no. So you've got to decide how much of this you've got to really, you know, walk, like, so that you're actually sweating, and how much of it you're going to be a tourist. Okay. So. Well, I'll just give a little quick little. You know, what about you, you say to yourself, all right, 20 minutes I'll do videoing. Yeah. And the rest of the time yeah. I'm going to walk. That's what I'm going to do. Does that sound reasonable? Yeah, sure. Could you still catch some magnificent stuff? Yeah, um. Well, when the camera reaches 20, when the camera reaches 20, I'm going to stop filming. Alright. And you remind me of that, alright? Yeah, alright. Okay. Somebody's in a big sprint. minutes, 12 more minutes and I'll cut it off. Oh no, you know, like, make it decent, you got to get around the cliff and get the cliff edge and, you know, don't, don't cut yourself short. People get so thin around here, people just walk around here all the time. Very, very popular place. Yeah. A lot of people come here. Come on this walking path, a lot mm. of people. Well, as I'm walking back to the beach, I'll record back the other way around. Mm. 
Well, if you've got it one way, I mean, you basically got it, haven't you? You wouldn't want to do the same thing coming back. You've already got it. Where are we going approaching up now? Big look, steps. Yeah, more steps here. Tell you what, this is trying you out, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. <sighs> I nearly fell over. <sighs> Dangerous place this can be. You could interpret it as a dangerous place, or you could interpret that maybe your fitness could be good. Probably like a return. Nothing like. Yeah, I saw some real black kind of eyes. Oh, really? What's on that? You get over towards that side, so closer to the, all the pretty scenery. Well, at the end of the track, I like to say a few words saying I'm at the end of the country. <laughs> On the eastern edge of Australia. Mm. Certainly where you are. <laughs> people, there are people, Stu, who actually run every day. They, they make it their exercise to run. You what mean? We, what we do in walking. So people run here all the time. And so it's just like their exercise track. And that's, some... that's right, that's what it is. That's... And no other people are so fit around here. Well, for people who want to enjoy life, being here. <laughs> that's it. When it rains, the water tumbles down there and keeps going down underneath us, down to the water. Get on that side so you're closest to all the pretty scenery. So if someone comes past you, they're not in the way of you filming. So you've got all that, you've done that. Yeah. Maybe a bit of the pathway, maybe. Sorry? Maybe you need a bit of the pathway. See how it goes around the cliff? That's yeah. a really nice thing to, to photograph, isn't it? Yeah. yeah someone's on a run. Always coming over here to be able to run, don't they? If you stay on this side, you won't have people getting in your film, view of your film. It'll be uninterrupted what you're trying to photograph. Okay. If you keep going onto this side, you've got bodies going in front of you and it gets in your. That's a whole idea. It's a whole idea. Oh, you want to get pictures of people? Yeah, why not? Oh. Makes it a bit more of a personal. 
another body running. <laughs> Up nearly 20 minutes of video. That's probably more than enough around here. <laughs> but yeah, most people, people live over here, this is ordinary to them. But some of you like. People that live over here, it's ordinary surroundings to them. Well, they would get used to it. Ooh. Ah! Oh, wow, oh, wow. Oh, bloody stupid rock. Oh. Stu, that's a perfect example of the difference between wearing big, clobbery boots yeah. and wearing walking shoes. That's the difference. Yeah. It's understandable, you'll catch that. Because you, you, you're slipping along, you're banging your feet. You, you actually got the hardest way of doing this. That's the hardest way. And people seeing me seem to be complaining like an idiot. It's not the stupid rock. You've got the wrong shoes on, man. <laughs> people probably think I speak from thinking put them on. That's a lovely scene, isn't it? <laughs> okay, now we go up the stairs. Hang on. This is shocking. Yeah. Right here. Oh. 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 See that? See this big cliff overhang? Yeah. See, and this pathway goes all around there, past that cemetery. Yeah. And keeps going. Eh? Oh, great. Hmm. You want to walk all down there, do you? All right. We've got another nine minutes. Let's go and catch some more, eh? Catch some more of the nice stuff. Here I'm walking along. Here I am walking on Bondi Beach in the heart of Bondi. <laughs> Nearly fell over rocks a few times, but I'm all right. Yeah. <sighs> what a day! I'm <laughs> walking, walking along the, one of Australia's most famous beaches. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> fell off the rock a few times, nearly fell back a few times on the steps. Oh, I'm alright. Here behind me is the water of Bondi, where Bondi is. Yeah.
Well, I've finished filming Bondi Beach. Um, I'll see you at the other end when I get back to the car. So, ciao. Here's some rocks along Bondi Beach cliffs. Here is some here is some housing along Bondi. Some residential area. There's the sun. Fitness equipment. Rocks. And that's it, finish. Oh, for, all right, and so that may got record there. Next. If we're smart, we'll be back and it'll be just a glimmer of light. And over there, a glimmer of light. <coughs> over there is the of the picnics today. And that is the surf club. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Over there is a tractor that pushes the sand back into the beach. Just, take, just catch the plane in the sky and say the planes are taking off seriously because we're really close to the airport. Oh, hang on, just let me get them. And they're all taking off to the east to catch the winds that are blowing from the east. I can't get it, I can't see the Oh, don't worry about it. Did you get the lovely pink on the horizon there? Yeah. Shall we head back? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Alright, if we, if we really like get back, just give us a tiny bit of light left. <laughs> well, that was a nice little video filming of this area. Yeah. I don't think people like being filmed, do they? <laughs> Um, Desiree, how about if you pick me up from here? The what? Pick me up here. No, we're going to go back. We're halfway. We've done a good halfway thing. We've got to enjoy get the full benefits, Duke. Bonty Beach. Bonty Beach. Here I am, making my way back to Bondi Beach to get back to the car. What a lovely day for you.
right, okay, let's go. Here's to so you can see what's down here, not over there, over this side, so you can get the full pathway. Dark now, we can't look into there. That's it, you got it. Okay. You got it now. Hey, say how proud you are. Hey? Yeah, say how proud you are now. Me walking like that. How proud I am. Yeah. <laughs> Been a good walk. Great walk. Yeah. yeah. Great spot. Lots of people going for a job. And Stu's getting into it. And that's exciting. Let's go, Stu. Let's go. Here I am at Bondi Beach at night. You can't see me very well. Uh, uh, uh. Here I am at Bondi Beach at night. I've just done a, a trek down the cliffs. Very, very proud of myself doing that. It was a good walk, puff and puff a bit. Now I'm out of puff now, like I can still talk on the camera. <laughs> See you back when I get back to Blacktown. Here I am walking along the beach of Bondi. Losing a bit of traction here, unfortunately. And I reckon I can do a good job. Here I am walking along Bondi Beach itself. Oh. <sighs> Oh, here I am, walking on Bondi Beach itself, losing traction. Here we are, back at Bondi Beach again. Oh, well, I nearly had a, nearly had a camera um, power, but... So you're going to cross the road, or...? Now, Stu. Yeah. We're done. We're done.
Eh sì. Oh. He nearly crashed into that thing. <laughs> People, people are here and they think, oh, what's this mad nut coming to here? Mm, yeah. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, to the cheese shop. <laughs> They're my funny sound effects, eh? So this is, and we made it, look at that, we've still got nearly 20 minutes before some, the shop shuts, so that's good. Yeah, some beam, some beam, uh, factory outlet, oh, I'll just give up a bit of a poke around in there, right? Eh? Yeah. There's a whole lot of factory outlets here, yeah. that's all electrical stuff there, yeah. which is very interesting. I saw an ice cream maker in there one day, and I should have bought it, it's a nice thing to... I have used an ice cream maker and they're yeah. really lovely. But the shop, the shoe shop is exactly opposite. So that's the place where I'm going to go. And the studio I'm going to go to the No, I'll just poke. I'll just poke around. I'll just poke around looking at looking, looking for the shop. You know, don't don't go too far because when we go, I want to know where you are. No, well, I'm staying here with you. I don't want to go anywhere else. All right. Well, either in this shop, yeah. or directly opposite where all the yellow is. All right. Well, I'll just come. I'll just come and stay with you. I want to stay. Well, I'll get off around this joint. We are. Yeah. I'm just going to use the lights. I don't want to... Yeah? I know that. I know that. I can see. I'm smart. I'm... Come on, you crazy lights! <sighs> well, I'm here at this crazy place and the lights know what to change. Come on! Crazy traffic lights.
Is that how exercise works? Exercise works with pushing the, 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 the blood around the body, gets rid of the impurities, yeah. okay? Um, it, it, it work, your muscles, you know, walking, like your muscles and your feet and your legs, yeah. you're working, any time you work your muscles, you're developing your muscles, yeah. you're using up um, protein, and so you're depleting the body of the nutrients that you've got in it. Yeah. So you're taking away the, the little bits of fat in your tissue because the body's burning it up. You see? No, oh, so you don't. And that burns the fat. That's that's right. So if I do a lot more of that, the fat just goes. And what we're doing is we're going to walk along this beautiful path. Yeah. And I'm really glad we're going now. That's why I'm sort of so hot be, be a bit miserable but now like it's just we, we're getting past the nasty heat of the day so it'll be quite pleasant now okay. now going down King's Cross are we going are we going towards King's Cross are we well I'll show you King's Cross is in the city yeah. we're actually going over here Do you so me King's go Cross is in the city yeah. But we're going to the east, what's called the eastern mm -hmm. suburbs, which is the ritzy part mm -hmm. of Sydney, where all the very moneyed people are. Moneyed people. Moneyed. Like they've got lots of money. Mm -hmm. and that's what I want. As a technician, that's what I want. I want to be money, money. I want to be, I want to have money, money, money. Would you like to be money too? I am already moneyed. I eat, I sleep at night, I um, am healthy, and I've got money enough to for eating, you know, to yep. pay my board and mum and dad's. So I figure that I'm probably richer than 90% of the people in the world. What about people like doctors and lawyers and all that? Well, they're, they're the elitists. They're in the top sort of 0.01%. But, but you and I are probably in the top 2% or 5%, believe it or not. It's hard to believe, isn't it? And you reckon, yeah. we're, and you reckon we're probably well off? We are very well off. There's a lot of people who don't get three meals a day in the world. And we're lucky. For how long we don't know, but to have appreciated what we well we can. Ah, Bondi, there's the sign. That's what we want. Bondi. Well, I reckon the government's help people buying brand new vehicles. I reckon we'll reduce the emissions. And um, just get scrap all, scrap all the old bombs. See that house there? Yeah. It's close to the city, isn't it? That's a house. Yeah. And look, you've got traffic screaming up and down in front of it. And that would probably drive that person in the house mad. You'd have to really like city living to live. I couldn't think of anything worse. Well, living in a living in a place that has cars everywhere. on the bush bike as well.
this must be the one of the elite part of Sydney, isn't it? Well, it's, we're getting into it, yeah, we are. I suppose Uncle Bill can't afford living up here, can he? <laughs> well, there's no, like, the, the way we see it, Stu, um, what's the point of being in, in, in an elite suburb when life is, the Lord has blessed Mum and Dad and, and myself really, really well where we are? What, what, what would be any benefit being over here? more close to the city, Mum. Well, what's the point of being close to the city? None of us go to the city much. It seems I like the city now. And that's, that's fine. exciting in the city. There's lots of um, lots of um, you go there because it's you get just about anything in the city. Plus you have the plus you get idiots. You get a few idiots around here, don't you? The traffic this light. is considered to be a very ritzy suburb. Must have been an accident there, that must be why. You can't go any further. Mm. It's been a big smash. Coppers look different than Victorian. A little bit different. Go up through there. Yeah, try that. I thought I'd see a police, off police officer around here though. Well, at least I saw one anyway.
that's where we want to get to. We'll see what's up. I don't want to get the cops mad in case they have to deck and you know, they can charge How me. How would you get the cops mad? I don't know. I don't know. Well, I don't want to push my luck. Now you're, there's some chucker out back there if, you, if you'd like it, Yeah, I, I'll have it when I get the Bondi. When you get there, okay. Just have some tucker out there, sit there somewhere at the beach and have some tucker out there, eh? All right. I said I ain't fish and chips, so I can eat some tucker. That's okay, we've got it all there for you. Mm -hmm. See, this is all residential, this is where people live. <laughs> Look at over there, Look, somebody's being stupid over there. What? Somebody's being stupid. <laughs> right one, Linda Scott, and they decided to put some spray paint over her face. Oh well. Mm. Bit of free speech there, eh? Somebody doesn't, somebody doesn't like her. Bondi Beach is pretty nice to, to visit. Mm. I've got a few Sydney friends, don't worry about that. I think it looks a fire truck over there. It's a fire truck over there. Must be a big smash. <laughs> I know I could have got my video camera out and zoom right into one, but I don't think the cops would have liked that, would they? <laughs> <laughs> it's a fire truck over there. I can see it. It's a fire truck over there. Bondi Beach is pretty nice to, to visit. Mm. I've got a few Sydney friends, don't worry about that. Uh, I think it looks a fire truck over there. It's a fire truck over there. Must be a big smash. <laughs> I know I could have got my video camera out and zoom right into one, but I don't think the cops would have liked that, would they? <laughs> <laughs> it's a fire truck over there. I can see it. It's a fire truck over there. Oh, the traffic is shocking around here, isn't it? Well, we're not far off peak hour. Peak hour? We're not far off it. Mm. Mm. But we certainly will wait when we get up there and we have a walk around. We won't be coming back until sort of like, you know, six o'clock or something like that. Maybe even 7 o'clock. See all these bikes? There's lots yeah. of them around here. Yeah, I wonder why. Yeah, give them a... Because it's so easy to get from one place to another. And they're so little, they can hide in amongst the cars. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Very good. Yeah, no one there. I wonder why there's this lot. People like bikes around here, don't they? Uh, makes it easier makes it easier for them to get around. see it now see it. and that's the edge of the Australian so mainland. We're getting close to Bondi Beach. And that's the end of Australia's mainland. That's right, we're on the eastern coast.
probably cooling off here a little bit because we're close to the ocean. Look at that, look, there's something on that bike. Look, look, there's something on that bike right now. I yeah. can see here how he's stuck down between those two cars. Yeah, the yeah, yeah. I do that on my little scooter. Oh, off he goes. <laughs> Oops. Hello. Oh, change lanes because I'm behind the bus. Oh, yeah. It's taking 10 I can't, I can't, don't come here every day, do I? No. This is probably the most popular beach in Sydney. Most popular beach around here? In Sydney. In Sydney itself? Yeah. Probably, yeah, probably because it's the closest. It's the closest to Sydney. It's the closest one. Here we are. Whoop. Here's Bondi Beach. Look at that breathtaking place. I wonder why. Look at, look at those people there waiting for the bus. A lot of them, isn't it? Yeah, look at them. Oh, look. Look, 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 look. People coming in the iPhone in, the, in, the, in, the, in, the, in a yellow car. <laughs> and we're going to park. Oh, the car Mm-hmm. 